Oh, Alright guys, sweet Jack Gamer Pro. Oh yeah, if you're wondering about my jersey, it's just from football. I do flag football. I joined on the... So I joined school, so I haven't been able to record as much. On the 28th, it's already like the third week of school. Or no, 29th, first day of school. But I started flag football on the Saturday. <laughs> that happened, so... Oh wait, no, it was a few Saturdays after. So today's the... Let me check. Today's the 16th, so I have it every Saturday. Um, six, 16th, so I had my first game on the 9th. Yeah, it wasn't good. Okay, so I'm going to be reviewing the Spider-Man Cross the Spider-Verse Snakers. There's one more coming in through Amazon, like it's added to the cart. So it's, Miguel's obviously, in my opinion, one of the best Spider-Man. If not the best. Even though there are a lot more Spider-Man. So it's kind of hard. Mason paid for this one, which was on sale for like five dollars. These, were <coughs> I got these from Target just today. Uh, oh god. Uh, is this any better? No, I don't think so. No, oh, these ones are a bit sharper. Oh, it's hard to cut. Um, yeah, basically what you expect when you get your stomach closed to the door, you can't hear it. But, um, in my opinion, this does not look like Miles from the movie, but, I mean, whatever. I mean, still like it, I guess. He has his Venom thing, I don't really know how this would work. But, you know, oh. Slide in. Yeah. Or maybe that's his webs, I can't even tell. I don't know why that means webs though. His webs aren't blue. His arm is like twisted. Maybe yeah, he's posable, I guess. The Miguel one that um this is like posable, I can tell. Yeah, so I can move 360 degrees. The legs do not move. They move like that, but that's it. Like a soldier walk, I guess. Which is what we do in sixth grade. Mm, we have to do a lot of stuff. Like they have a program called Pre Athletics. I don't know why I'm telling y'all about this. I'm just letting you know. I guess it's an update. But yeah, pretty cool. This doesn't move at all, but it attaches. So this is the box. I got these at Target, but it was on sale on Amazon, and they do like a price thing. Um, so yeah, it's, I'll read the description. Miles Morales faces a new villain with abilities that will take more than one Spider-Man to defeat, which we all know that's a spot if you haven't watched it, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, not the spot. I'm not going to do any spoilers in this. If you haven't watched the movie, and then you need to go watch it. It's like one of the best Spider-Man movies. Maybe the best one, to be honest. I think Beyond the Spider Verse will be. Probably, I can already expect to see some deaths. So. Tell me in the comments below if you think Miles will save his dad. or anything it's gonna break it so but yeah his legs do not move except for this like they don't bend or anything yeah his head can move 360 degrees pretty cool of course i'm gonna get the big l but later i'll probably clip it with this one 
the Miguel smaller one. And then I have the. Uh, I'm gonna read the spot real quick. The spot. If the spot can realize the true power of his abilities, he can become a threat to the entire multiverse. There's the back. And then we have Miguel O'Hara. So, I'm going to go ahead and read this. Miguel O'Hara tried to manipulate the genetics of former Spider-People and accidentally turned himself into the best Spider-Man in the entire multiverse. So, here he is. Titan so Hero series. I have a few. This is like my only or Spider Man figures that are like the smaller ones that just came out. Comment down below if you think uh, Miles is going to save his dad. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I don't know why I said that. If you don't know what I'm talking about, don't like worry about it. Just watch the movie first and you'll know what I mean. Unless you've already heard online or something. An easier way to open things. Don't always turn the box. This is something I should probably do. Uh, is there anything? I don't know, there's something else. I got Miguel. It's already out. Oh, crap, I forgot this one. Fall. There's probably a better way to do that. Anyways, we got. Miguel O'Hara, his head can turn 360. His legs go like this. His legs do not, like they're kind of, like the blades are um, not, they do not move. They're kind of flexible, but they're, no, they're not meant to move at all. This is like the Venom one, or and the Black Panther kind of, like the with the hands. No, this is more like Black Panther, I think, because I have both of them. Anyways, you can see the design is really detailed. It looks just like the movie. So does the spot. Except this leg kind of looks like a little wonky right here. I think that's not anything. You know, the back, I did, um, Miles, he doesn't have it, but the back, he has, like, those little screw things. I don't know what right here is for, so I'm going to look at that real quick. I don't think there's anything in, yeah, there's nothing in there. I didn't expect there to be even Mason told me. Wait, there's a bag in here? Oh, hold on. Uh, I know there's a better way to do this, but, oh, there's not a bag. Let's just take a look at it. Yeah, I didn't do anything. Yeah, I didn't tear the box or anything. Anyways, this is pretty cool. Look, he can T-pose. Like in the movie, I can make stop motions, maybe. Not, maybe not with this side. Or like the other, I don't know, maybe. The head, I feel like he'd have been more, like, the head just isn't as shiny or, like, as this isn't as detailed, or I feel like they could have done something. Good. I don't know, it's just not as shiny blue. But I mean, I don't really know what else they could do. They could twist the, they could twist his arms like that. Yeah, well, thank you so much for watching, except we do have the smaller ones, so I'm just gonna click with this, so yeah. I don't know when that's gonna be though, so bye. For you, it's just like a second, so yeah.